Hey guys, how's it going? Me Tom here. Uh, just another video of another remote control uh, ducted fan unit here. Tiny little 50 millimeter uh, EDF in there. It's an F86 Sabre. And um, I did have to make a few modifications. Number one, the fan was rubbing and grinding, so I had to um, do some adjustments to the EDF in there, the fan. Um, because it was way out of balance, it was scraping on the side. As soon as I put it back in, uh, after removing it, to put it in ESC, which is an 18 amp Castle Creation, uh, the motor was rubbing all over the place. And it still rubs a little bit, and it's just another one of these uh, real cheap, uh, cheap old fans that they put in these units, but it, it'll fly it anyway. Uh, this will be my second battery on the aircraft. So uh, the other, the only other mod that, um, I made here is there goes a hole right there because they say in the manual that this goes uh, an 850 milliamp battery in here or um, 900 well I put that in there and it barely fit and also uh, it was way tail heavy so I needed more weight so what do you do when you need more weight you get a 1350 and you put the 1350 in there right and it just barely comes through and it actually serves as cooling for the uh, cooling for the battery through there and it only comes through like it doesn't even come all the way through so it works out pretty good and then to secure it I put velcro here on the canopy which uh, keeps the battery from dropping all the way into the intake kind of kind of secures it in there so um, it works. It keeps the airplane real um, level. It's not um, tail heavy anymore. So um, I didn't even try it with the 800 milliamp because it was way tail heavy. So uh, I'm gonna put the batteries put on this hat cam and uh, try and keep it on the airplane as I put the battery in. But if you can't see it, it there it is. I had to remove foam once again. Just uh, reset it, try it one more time. So the only other mod too, I put on some landing skids here and some plastic back here to save the aircraft. When I take it up to the asphalt field. There we go. So it, uh, it won't get chewed up, I can still fly it up there. Anyways, I'm just tucking this in here as best as I can here. It's running on two servos only. I don't know if you can see that right there. It's not even poking through the bottom. And then the lid just sticks on with a, a magnet. And then what I do, I just press down on the battery a little bit. So it mates up with that Velcro inside there. You did. All right. So it pushes about 140 watts and draws about I don't know 14 amps or so. So uh, here we go. Second battery on the saber. Oh, it's not a, a a speed demon or anything, but it's a pretty cool little park flyer. Oh, we almost lost it. I hope we got that on film. I want to try that maneuver without some more speed.
Oh, it's good. Stock, stock motor and ESC. There we go. There's another roll. Try and keep it on a little close. Keep the power in the turns. So that's a 1350 in there now, right? So you should get a good five to eight minutes. It rolls. That's all right. Looks cool in here. It's a little EDF. Doesn't really have any vertical. It's cool though. Bring it around and try it out for a loop. I'll bring it up pretty high though. Alright guys, what do you think? It's pretty cool in here, huh? Probably get a few more minutes out of it. A 1350 milliamp. Such a tiny motor. I don't know guys, I just I had to get one of these. It was 40 bucks, guys. 40 bucks with the motor and the uh, EDF. Just cruising around at half throttle here, guys. Punch it. Alright guys, that's about it. I'm bring it around one more time. Ain't in for a down one landing. Right in front of me. vertical <laughs> there it is guys did a little cartwheel I don't know if you caught that but a uh, little cartwheel of a plane there F86 and uh not a bad little park flyer here, guys. You know the battery comes out with it. See that, guys? Just peel that off. Battery's not even warm. Shouldn't be with a 1350 on that little tiny EDF. I don't know, guys. I think I missed that landing, but as you can see, no damage, and it just uh, rolled right in. The CG is right on right on the money where they tell us 107 centimeters back. So hope you enjoyed the vid guys and uh, stay tuned for more fun. Don't forget subscribe.